Nonprofit aiming to strengthen families living through childhood cancer is back in Emerald Isle for the summer. On your side, Cheyenne Pagan takes us to the Lighthouse Family Retreat and tells us how it's impacting those families. With over 100 local volunteers working to make this experience unforgettable, this will be the retreat of a lifetime for the families attending. Sophia was diagnosed with leukemia 10 years ago. Her family decided to try out the Lighthouse Family Retreat then, and they fell in love. The week of Lighthouse was the most amazing week for our family. So much so, they came back this year to volunteer. See that change that can, I can do for other people, like Lighthouse did for me, it just feels good. And they aren't the only ones who were drawn back to the retreat. Um, Bo was nine months when he was diagnosed. Um, he went through about two years of treatment and other things. Luke Woosley's little brother survived cancer, and after his family went through the retreat, he knew he was going to come back. This experience helps these families with lots of fun. Coloring, painting birdhouses, um, they can play games. We have football. Um, we have, you know, any touch balls, this blue thing over here, it's nine square. It's like four square, but in the air. And connections. Cancer affects everybody, but I think pediatric cancer specifically, it's, it's a smaller group of people. And I think allowing them to have other people to connect to um, and really uh, share their experiences with is very beneficial for not only the, like the people themselves, but the family dynamic. And at the end of the day, their ultimate goal is to strengthen these families as they continue on with the rest of their journey. You have a huge family around you, surround you with so much love and so much care and so much service. This location will be their last stop in North Carolina for their 2022 summer series of retreats in Emerald Isle. Cheyenne Pickett 9 on your side.